the sun, the clouds will bubble up during the heating of the day, and we could get at least a few widely scattered showers, a peppering of showers tomorrow, maybe an isolated rumble of thunder with that. And then tomorrow night, as those clouds break up and push off to the east, Clear, calm conditions will allow for at least patchy frost to form in places, especially as you head north and northeast. And then a warmer and drier regime with the potential of the severe weather threat coming back around May 11th. Notice on future cast tonight, though, again, you can see where the most widespread light rainfall is. Down in our southeast, as we put this in motion, notice again, right into the overnight, the rain's down this way. There could be a few showers up here, but better coverage as you head southeastward. And then for the afternoon tomorrow, little sun, clouds bubbling up, and at least a peppering of a few showers, perhaps an isolated rumble of thunder. And then the clouds clear tomorrow night, and that means patchy frost. Highs tomorrow, though, will be cool in the northeast. Only 52 at Rochester, 54 Peru, but 60 here in Lafayette, 61 Attica, and about 58 at Burlington and Monticello. But tomorrow night, as things go calm and things clear out, 36 Lafayette and Frankfurt, and then up towards Rochester and Winnemac, right around freezing, 34 Peru and 37 at Crawfordsville. If you're like me and have gotten your tomatoes out a little early, you'll want to cover those up. And rainfall, this is tonight through tomorrow. Again, maybe around four-tenths of an inch at Thorntown and Tipton, about a quarter of an inch Kokomo, 1,600 Slafia, and only one one hundred there at Rensselaer. Areas of rain, mainly to the southeast, 43 tonight, 60 tomorrow, clouds with some sun with a peppering of showers around. But there's the warmer weather. Notice how it dries out somewhat, Gina, and it does warm up into the 70s towards Friday, Saturday, and 80 degrees on Monday, but the severe weather threat returning. Right, okay, well, some frost. We haven't said that in a while. <laughs> yeah, not much, but again, cover the really sensitive stuff. Okay, Chad, thank okay. you. The numbers are startling. New research finds...